Neil Harris has um, had a tight budget um, to work with, like a lot of clubs. He's obviously not going to come out and see how much he's got to spend because he's going to up the price of the players he's after. But he's done a, a bit of good business at the moment. He's got a decent full backing by the looks of it, a, a prospect. Not, not so much a youngster, but he's played a bit of, uh, had a lot of experience in German football last season. And he's quite pacey. It's an area of the field that's um, has been a concern for me, the two full backs. Um, strength in depth and um, obviously a bit of quality um, needed there in my opinion. So that, that firstly that was a, a good move and obviously we got a, um, a proven goal scorer in Kiefer Moore which is another another good sign in. It looks like we've managed to keep hold of uh, the majority of our squad which is really good. Um, they are a good squad of players, they're experienced, they've been there, done it before and they got nearly got us through last season. So. Just one or two bits and pieces, so I'm I'm not really frustrated about everything. I understand where we are in the world at the moment with finances. Football's in a bit of a mess, and a, it's a financial meltdown. Looking like it's only around the corner if we can't get fans back in the stadium. So we've just got to accept it. Um, all clubs are the same. There ain't too many spending big, especially in the championship this season. Uh, quite a few have had um, got points deductions hanging over their heads. So. It's not going to be a, an easy campaign for any team down there. Lee Tomlin played the season. I think um, he, you know, it's, it, was, it was a difficult choice um, this season. We didn't start off too well. Tomlin won in the side. Um, he's definitely our most creative player. And based on that, he um, when he comes on the pitch, he makes an impact. And he always has the same again. It's probably quite right, he's, he's just shaded it.